Okay, I'm now on part three of the leftover crochet sock and I'm going to show you how to do the heel. Um, I'm going to introduce a new colour because this is very clear. Hopefully my hands aren't going to be quite as close as they have been in the last two videos. I've just been playing around with how to do this. We're going to work this in rows rather than rounds and I'm using single crochet which is UK double crochet stitch for the heel because it needs to be um, stronger. Uh, so this is an area where you want single crochet. So I'm going to do um, 13, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, um, 8, 9, 10, 11, so I'm going to do um, single crochets across half, half of the sock and then I'm going to turn and work single crochets back. So I'm just working in rows and I'm working on half of the stitches for this heel. And I'm going to go all the way across but I'm not going to work into the last stitch. So. There were 13 on the first row and there will be 12 on this next row because I'm not going to work into this final, final stitch here and I'm going to turn around. Turn again and I'm going to work um, 11 and I'm not going to work into that final stitch and I'll I'll just carry on going and then I'll show you what this little wedge heel looks like um, when I'm done. So now I have um, eight stitches across the top and you can see that I haven't worked into, um, there's an unworked stitch here. So on my next row, so I've done my little wedge, this is like the bottom of the heel, and now I'm going to turn the heel. So I'm going to uh, single crochet across, and this will be eight single crochets. That's, um, when I get to the end of the row, I am going to, it's kind of tough getting it in there, right, um, I'm going to go down and I'm going to work into that unwork um, stitch which is two rows below um, and I'm going to do it quite tightly so there's no gap. So I've worked into that with single crochet and then I'm going to slip stitch and turn and then I'm going to go back and I'm I'm going to work into that slip stitch. I'm going to single crochet into that first single crochet and that will be nine and I'm going back this way and when I get to the end of the nine single crochets, it's the last one, a little bit difficult to get into, right and then I'm going to go into the unworked stitch from two rows below. So you get the, get the idea here. So single crochet there and keep that quite tight and then slip. And you can see that my heel is starting, starting to turn my heel. So I'm just going to keep going until I've picked up all of those unworked stitches and I'll show you what it looks like at the end. So here I am, I'm back with the, um, the heel and I've turned and now we actually have like a little wedge which is starting from 13 stitches, decreasing down and then back out again by picking those up and joining them and it's 13 stitches again and now we're ready to start working all the way around again for the leg. I hope that's been useful.